Brady pumps, looking for Brown deep, and throwing for Brown. He's got it at the 30, the 20, the 10. The Patriots have won. Look at him storm the field. A remarkable victory by New England. And the Dolphins' defensive line was too exhausted to mount any kind of a pass rush. And Brady threw that ball as far as he humanly could as Brown kept running deep, 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 and Brady had loaded all he had and found Brown on the fingertips. An 82-yard winning touchdown. Troy Brown right between the two safeties for the Dolphins, Brock Marion and Sammy Knight, but both of them, I'm sure, not believing that Tom Brady could stand with the football as long as he did. Brady now 6-0 in overtime, and the jinx of September and October ends on this day for New England. They finally won in Miami. Troy Brown just simply running a deep out, and take a look at, at, at Marion and Knight first. He runs behind both of them because neither one of them, I'm sure, can believe that a quarterback could hold the ball that long to get it that deep. 82 yards, and Brady with the heroics, finding Brown with an absolutely perfect pass, and for Bill Belichick, the mild-mannered, uh, conservative personality of the Patriots, he becomes a sophomore cheerleader. And Alindo Mari, who missed a very makeable field goal, I'm sure will have a restless night but what about the New England Patriots? All their injuries, all their frontline players that aren't able to play. And this team, after getting blown out by the Buffalo Bills on opening day, has rebounded to take first place in the AFC East. Now, what, what do you say about this group of men for the Patriots? Well,